gigantic dream cruises, a flagship of Resort World Cruises. It's a pioneer and a trendsetter in the hospitality for 50 years. A luxury cruising experience like none other. It brings to you a fresh, noble experiences and an array of cuisines, entertainment and themes from across the globe for a cruise that's limited only by our imagination. And I'm super excited for my first ever cruise holiday with Ganting Dream Cruises. Just got to see this beautiful giant Ganting Dream Cruise and oh my goodness, she's huge, she's massive, she is beautiful. I'm all excited to explore her and show you the entire cruise for the next three days. So follow me. As I entered, I had a very warm and approachable welcome. From there, I straight away headed to deck 6 to the reception area to do my check-in process. The check-in process was really smooth and I just had to hand over my passport and collect my room keys. So from there, it's time to go to my room. Can you believe this is a ship and it, it almost looks like a hotel for me. Maybe it's because of my first ever cruise holiday. That's why I'm feeling like, oh my God, everything is like surprising. I think it's once in a lifetime thing that you have to do. So there are about 19 floors in this ship. Oh my God, that's like wow. So I'm staying at the 13th floor. So get ready to check out my room. I had taken a palace suite. It's a brand new elevated experience in Genting Dream Cruises. It comes with all-inclusive privileges like all-suite accommodation, 24 hours butler service and lot of other benefits on your arrival in your suite room, when you dine and when you explore as well. So here's my room and this is one of its kind of an experience because in cruise you're having such a beautiful space to stay in with amazing bed and a couch and also a very beautiful view to die for. A cruise holiday comes with an all-inclusive access which means your breakfast, lunch and dinner is a part of your cruising experience. And also staying in palace in the Genting Dream Cruises means you have a 24 hours palace restaurant available for you at your service. I straight away went there and ordered some fries and sandwiches along with some fruits and I had a great late evening lunch with a beautiful view. Right now I'm going to the 15th floor to check out the spa and the fitness center. Come with me. Crystal Life Spa in the Genting Dream Cruises gives you an absolutely luxurious feeling. Probably this is one of the most luxurious spa I have ever been in my life. As I entered, I was taken to a space where the guests can come in and actually share the kind of experience they're looking for. I was then taken to a spa tour where I saw a lot of elements which had its own health benefits like the pools which you're seeing right here. It's a hot water pool and then there is a cold water pool where you can take a dip in and then I was taken to a sauna which you can control the temperature by yourself. So this is the massage center at the Genting Dream Cruise and it is amazingly beautiful. You feel so royal, you feel, uh, you know, it's, it's a very luxurious feeling and I'm all set to experience this and I'll see you after one hour. Bye bye. Welcome. Well now let me take you to a gym tour and this gym in Genting Dream Cruises is fully equipped. It has a cardio section, weightlifting and whatnot, and also comes with a brilliant sea view. And if you want to check your height, your weight, you have your room to be Wow! I want... How much? Let's see. So it's 168 centimeters. And do you know what is your weight here? No, no, no. <laughs> can you roll? Roll, no. <laughs> I can do this, I can do this. Why Or shoulder press. Oh, no. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> I thought I'd try. Uh, no. <laughs> and it's a beautiful gym and uh, I think uh, it, it, it doesn't definitely feel like you're on a cruise, you're like, you just have everything in this ship and uh, I mean all the equipment are there so if you're a gym freak so you don't have to worry that you're gonna, you know, you're gonna miss your gym, you just have to come here and hit the gym in the morning and the best part about this gym is the view when you're gymming and you have the access to this beautiful view of the sea. What more do you need to make your day amazing? So this is the giant ship. So there's a miniature of Antic Dream Cruise here. And right now, if you come around... Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. This is your captain Robert Police speaking to you from the navigational bridge. Right now I'm heading to Deck 8 for Umi Uma restaurant and this is a special multi cuisine restaurant where chef is gonna show his art of cooking here at Getty Cruise and I'll be having two special guests joining me and this is on special invite. Umiuma, it's a luxury dining experience in the Genting Dream Cruises. It serves Korean barbecue and the Japanese teppanyaki. Teppanyaki is a style of Japanese cuisine that uses iron griddle to cook food. The word teppanyaki is derived from teppan, the metal plate on which it is cooked and yaki means grilled, boiled and pan fried, which also means the food in the cruise is cooked with absolutely zero fire. Like I said, I had two special guests. One is my best buddy Alok and I also had Ashika Rangnath from Karnataka who's a beautiful actress joining in. They were apparently shooting for a music album so we got together for a dining experience. Honestly, I didn't know how to use the chopsticks and then Alok helped me with it and then we had a great time trying out different dishes which is absolutely mouth-watering and I love the chicken there. After dinner, I went on to have some me time near the pool area, walking around. It was breezy, peaceful and really calm. The colourful ambience and the calmness of the ship really made me feel very good. I just stood there for some time thinking what next. On the day two, I knew I wanted to do a lot of things in the cruise, so I started my day very early. I went on to the Lido restaurant in the Deck 16 to have my breakfast. Lido restaurant was massive and had so many options for breakfast. I was really confused what to eat and what not to. Being a South Indian by heart, I straight away hit the Indian section to grab some amazing and delicious Indian breakfast. If you prefer having a Jain food, don't worry at all, you have that too and what not. Well, I grabbed my food and went on to have my breakfast with a beautiful view of the sea. 
and right now I am here at the main pool area. So this place is very huge, massive and has a lot of recreational activities. So if you see there, you can see the water slides. Oh my god, water slides in a cruise like an amusement park. It's like just a wow feeling. And then it's a huge pool, there is hot tub, there is jacuzzi, there's a lot of other activities. We are at the 17th deck which means the topmost deck of the ship and you get a beautiful view of this ship and if you just come forward you can see, you can just stand here and experience the waves, you know the, the calmness of the ship. So this happens to be my favourite spot as well. Here I am at the Sports Activity Centre, it's also called as Sportsplex. You have so many things to do here. You have mini golf, you have basketball, you have rope course and what not. So let me take you around, come with me. It is right now, I'm here at the rope course area where you get to experience all the rope activities both for kids and adults. And this area, if you're trying this, it's gonna take about like 15 minutes and depends on person. It may go up to 45 minutes as well if you are a little slow. So this area is something very adventurous and you must try when you're here. The cruise has so much to offer and there is no limit on it. Right now I'm in this area where you can play chess with your family. And if you're a chess lover, make sure you don't miss this area when you're here at the cruise. So right now here I am at the mini golf area in the cruise. So if you are a golf lover, this is something you should not miss when you are on board. And it comes with a beautiful sea view, so it's a place you must do. So here at the cruise you also have table tennis and a lot of other activities. So right now I am trying my hand. I am really not good at this. I am just trying it for the first time. I'm here at the basketball court in the Genting Dream Cruises. Every place here is actually making me feel mesmerized because on a moving ship, you have a basketball court and you can have the complete 360 degree view of the ocean and you are playing your favorite sport. How does it feel like? So make sure you come, make some time and play basketball with your family and friends right here. So when I showed you the rope course activity, I thought why not I try it, so I'm going to try it now. I just finished my rope course activity and it was a next level experience. I'll tell you why because this was the first ever time I tried something with a rope and this was different because you know I'm, I'm, I'm doing that rope activity and you have a huge ocean right in front of you and a moving ship and this is an experience that I will cherish for a lifetime. So when you are here in the cruise, make sure you try this rope activity. In fact, I was a little scared. So don't be worried. Uh, it's, you know, it's absolutely safe. You know, you have that safety measures taken care of very well because you're, you're just moving right next to the ocean as you see there. And you know, if you just see this, it's, it's like it's a deep ocean and the ship is moving. It was one of the best experiences of my life, so make sure you try this without fail. After all that adventure at the sports place, right now I'm here at the Silk Road. It's a Chinese restaurant here in the Gantry Green Cruises and this place is known for its ambience. And I'm all set to try these Chinese cuisines. So come with me. Wow, what a beautiful ambience. I feel this is one of the most beautiful restaurants that I have ever been to. So this is a Chinese restaurant and I'm all set. You can see the table, it's so well set and this is absolutely a epitome of luxuries what I can say because 
the ambience is so rich and even you have a live theater here and there's a lot of performances that happens when you dine in here and there's something special there is a adult show which happens when you are dining here so you'll have to book a slot book a table for yourself before coming here because you cannot just walk in like that so make sure when you are here at the Getty Cruises do not miss to visit the Silk Road Hi everyone, today I'm here to show you the Genting Dream Cruises room tour. So just follow me and there are multiple ranges of rooms and everything has its own features and benefits. So come with me and I'm going to show you the entire palace villa and a lot of other things. Palace Villa, it's known to be one of the biggest staterooms in the Genting Dream Cruises. It's about 224 square feet and it has multiple facilities. You have two rooms, one for the guest and one the master room and you have an exclusive bar here for yourself and you will have 24 hour service where you can order anything at your comfort of your room. mother of a six-year-old, I always think what's in there for my kid wherever I go. Here at the Gending Dream Cruise, you have a lot of exciting things exclusively for kids. Right now, you're seeing this place called Arcade, where kids can come here and have a great time exploring a lot of video games and other fun activities. And also, they do have something exclusive called Dreamers Club, where you can also drop off your kids while you and your partner have an amazing time at the cruise. Genting Dream Cruise is known for its world-class theatre production. Here at the Zodiac Theatre, you get to watch some of the world-class performances from best artists across the world. So when you're here, do not miss to visit this amazing place to witness mind-blowing performances.
And so I'm here at the boutique of Genting Dream Cruises by which I mean this is a place for shopping lovers. It almost looks like a mall and you name the brand, you have it right here and it's duty free. So if you are visiting the Genting Dream Cruises, do not forget to visit this amazing boutique with all the luxury brands you love. Hey everyone, so right now I'm heading to the Zouk nightclub to party. So it's a neon party and let's have fun. So follow me, let me take you there. Can you say Namaste to our Indian? Hi, namaste. 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 No stove, no gas, no fire, and it's all electric. And this is a vegetarian section in the galley area, and uh, you can see it's completely sanitized and it's very very clean. Honestly, uh, this ship serves food for almost about 3,000 plus people. Yes. So 3,000 plus people, and this space is absolutely clean there is not a small mess that you can see around it's so well maintained and hats off to you people <laughs> Thank you so much. It's not my birthday, but thank you so much. I'm heading towards something very, very exciting. So this is called Bridge Tour. I'm going to meet the captain of the ship, which is like, oh my God, kind of an experience because this is my first time in the cruise and I'm getting to experience so many things and meeting a captain is definitely not easy. And I think this is once in a lifetime opportunity and I'm excited for it. Can we go? Yes. Hello, Captain. Good morning. How are you? Nice to meet you. So, where we have the officers, I'm not, I'm not the one driving the ship. Hey everyone, I'm here at the Deck 9 and to experience yet another once in a lifetime moment. I'm visiting the helipad at the Genting Dream Cruises. I'm going to show you around the entire experience of how it feels like to go there near the helipad and yeah, just follow me. Oh my god. So this is the front edge of the Genting Dream Cruises right now, the helipad. So what is helipad? This is where the helicopter lands and takes off and this view has my heart. So that's your helipad tour and I really want to thank the Genting Dream Cruises and the Travel Mart for giving me this opportunity to explore these amazing places which is unseen and unheard and not everybody gets an opportunity to get here. So yes, I'm feeling very happy but there's a lot more in store. I'm going to show you the entire ship so keep watching the video.
right now I'm heading for my lunch at the Bistro restaurant which is named after a chef who is working here from so many years. So let's check it out. going to try a five course meal which is of a western cuisine and honestly it's a beautiful spread and it looks very colorful uh, dining western cuisine with all of this in front of me I really can't wait to eat that Well, from there, I straight away hit the foam party, which was super fun, and we danced our heart out. Here at the Genting Dream Cruise, foam parties are very famous for its fun element. So, when you're here, do not miss it. Hey everyone, so I'm here at the 7th deck and I have a special invitation for a dinner at the Dream Dining Restaurant here at the Genting Cruises. And this is a continental and Chinese restaurant, so I'm all set to explore it. Follow me. Wow, what a evening it has been. So the gala dinner was just amazing. We had some amazing food and there was dance, music. Wow, just beautiful. So right now I thought, why not I try my hands on the casino. So I'm heading towards the casino here at the Genting Dream Cruises, which is almost open round the clock. But I thought, let me know, I try it right now. So I'm gonna go there, but you know what? There are no cameras allowed, so. Three days here at the Genting Dream Cruise has been amazing and I've created lots and lots of memories and I'm gonna definitely come back. So if you're looking forward to create such experience for yourself then all you gotta do is get in touch with Travel Mart and Travel Mart will help you book all these services at priority. So what are you waiting for? Just get in touch with us and we will get it sorted for you. Thank you. It was a great time. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let's go home. Bye-bye!